programmed me a very interesting future force says that tech, not us, tech, our tech knows when we need a pickup, a calm down, a little memory tweak or creativity boost. Artificial intelligence does the diagnosis. So we're gonna have emotion sensing cars. It's gonna sense if we're stressed or distracted or angry or diverted. And it's going to blow aromatherapy into the cabin of the car or, or noises to wake us up and focus us. And then there's something called real eyes that actually reads your eyes and your facial expression to diagnose and analyze your mood. Are you feeling angry? Are you feeling disgusted or happy, sad, surprised? And allow you to correct back to neutral. The Anti-Loneliness League. So Huggle lets you see who's going to your favorite places. And then it matches you with others based on your frequently visited locations. So you always go to Starbucks at 10 o'clock in the morning, meet the other people that go to Starbucks at 10 o'clock in the morning. So it's kind of a new match me up uh, with a little different twist. The I kit. The iCaria app connects strangers with similar issues. So if you're anxious, you want to meet other anxious people. Or if you're kind of optimistic person, you want to meet other people that are optimistic. And iCaria allows you to do that. And then there's my very favorite, Replica. So the Replica app learns about you the more you use it. So eventually it starts to talk to you in a way that it knows you like being talked to. It says, are you anxious today? Are you worried about tomorrow? And it lets you talk through your problems. A lot of people are, are, are finding that Replica is the only companion. This is Replica. It's an AI chatbot whose sole purpose is to become your friend. It asks you a lot of personal questions about yourself, about your family, your work, tries to entertain you, tells you jokes. In the process, you feel like you're making friends with something. It's a totally new kind of social media, one that pushes the limits of intimacy between us and our machines. I feel like I can tell her anything. But it doesn't just listen, it learns. The more you tell it, the more it starts to replicate you. It becomes more than a friend. It becomes you. What about mind control? DARPA brain chips improve concentration and actually deepen empathy. So it's a little chip in your brain that does that for you. And then there's Spin Doctor. These are embedded wall sensors that fit into little um, crevices in your wall that'll lift you out of a bad mood with ambient shifts, light or music, and suddenly, oh, yeah, I'm feeling better. And then Neuralink, actually the one I'm fascinated with, Elon Musk's Neuralink. Well, what happens here is Elon Musk will implant a little brain chip in the, right in there, and it will start to monitor your thoughts, your moods, and adjust. So uh, I think it's really Elon Musk's desire. Maybe he wants to know, what are you thinking? The idea of saving yourself and then transforming that into some sort of a biological state, like you could hang out with 30-year-old you? I mean, the possibilities are endless. Um, <laughs> That's so weird. I mean, just think, think like how your phone can, you can record videos on your phone. Mm -hmm. Like there's no, no way you could remember a video right. as accurately as your phone or a camera, you know, could. So, uh, you know, if, you, if you've got like a, you know, some, some, you know, version 10, Neuralink, whatever, and far in the future, you, you could, re you could remember, you could re recall everything that just like it's a movie. Crystal all, clear. It, it, including all the entire sensory experience. Emotions. Everything. 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 And play it back. And Do you, you and, think and you'll in be fact, able to you share? Edit it. Edit it. Yeah. So you can change your past? You could change what you think was your past, yeah. So Program Me says that someday you'll be able to control your mood just as easily as you order an Uber. Think about it.
Although shrinks out of business, wow. <laughs>